The first sign of problems in a plant usually shows up in the foliage. These guys here are super healthy, however, these guys here, as well as these guys, have some issues. Hi, I'm Jeff from the Ripe Tomato Farms, and welcome to another episode of The Garden Quickie, where in two minutes or less, we solve the most pressing garden issues of the day. And today is all about the tomato leaf curl. Tomato leaf curl is exactly what the name suggests and is when the leaves of some or all of the tomato plant curl up and inwards. There's three main reasons why this happens and we're gonna cover all three. The first and most likely cause is physiological. That is, it's a response by the plant to an environmental stimuli that it doesn't like. Usually, this would be excessive heat and or drought. In this case, the tomato plant is literally curling its leaves to reduce the surface area to conserve as much fluids as possible. And while the damage is not irreversible or life-threatening to the plant, or even contagious for that matter, intermittent drought and temperature stress like this will take its toll. It may affect your fruiting productivity and in severe cases, even lead to blossom end rot. Fix the stress sooner than later by watering more, mulching, and in extreme cases, even moving the plant or possibly erecting shade cloth. The second cause for leaf curl would be herbicide or pesticide drift. Not nearly as common, but if you had a neighbor spray or maybe the city or municipality on a windy day, a portion of that spray could end up on your plants, causing the leaf curl. It's not very common, but there's also not much you can do about it, other than maybe asking your neighbors to be very careful when they're broadcasting their poisons. And lastly, we have the most damaging cause of leaf curl and one where you have to actually dispose of the entire plant, which thankfully is not affecting this tiny Tim, and that's the tomato leaf curl virus. If your tomato plant's foliar issues are not solved by dealing with that environmental stress, you could be dealing with disease. The best way to test for this is to water thoroughly the night before and check the leaves the next morning. If they're still curled, misshapen, or starting to get spots, the plant must be removed from your garden. Now, don't compost it, truly. You have to burn the plant or throw it away. All right, guys, if you do happen to get tomato leaf curl this year, I do hope it's because your plants are thirsty and that it's hot out. I also hope that you'll check out the next episode of The Garden Quickie. Thanks for watching, guys. And hey, if Garden Quickies are your thing, be sure to click on this playlist here as we explore and solve more growing issues in two minutes or less.